some of college football's most legendary figures. Elway, Luck, Sherman, and McCaffrey. And today, the Stanford Cardinal will try to live up to that legacy. Today, a clash between a couple of ACC rivals in a game that could have big-time implications for the rest of the season. As we'll see, the Pittsburgh Panthers taking on the winners of four straight, the Stanford Cardinal. For EA Sports College Football, I... To give to the lone running back. And he runs through in the passing game in a lot of different situations. That time, perfect coverage. A nice job bringing from the 25. From the gun, wants to pass. Throws to the back. Catch in the middle, it's Wallace. Able to work it to the 39 yard line, and that'll be a first down. Fresh set of downs after the completion. They're working that left side. At the 35, he's open. Big, big gain on that one as he steps out of bounds with a first down. I know it's early. Coming out on first down with the play fake. Fires a ball, and now it's picked off. And they'll drag him down after a good return on the interception. And the senior just snatched the ball out of the air and... <laughs> Leaves it with the back. What a good... going to lose a yard on that one. Lost one on that last one. It's second and 11. To the ground with the back. Found a little space, and he's got four to the 35. After the last run, would you just give it to him again on third down? Looking to throw, it's Daniels. Spits it out to the back. He makes the catch. Listen, running backs are not just running backs anymore. You're going to be a wide receiver in today's football. And a great job sneaking out of the backfield, getting the football, letting them get some positive yards. What a nifty one there to... Off the play fake on first down. Throwing right. Makes a connection. Works his way to the 41, and that is plenty to give him a first down. Big chunk play to start this drive. Now they'll really try to take it to this defense. Making sure they have good balance, keeping it on the ground. Creating some space, getting just enough good blocking, and they've got it up to the 47-yard line. On third and short, they'll try to convert through the air. Got it in the middle, it's McCoy. That'll be enough for the first down as they stop him at the 43-yard line. This Stanford offense moving quickly down the field. Fires to the wideout. Wide open downfield. That is exactly what you're looking for when you talk explosive plays. The defense. To the air, it's Daniels. Unloads to the wideout. And... They'll run it. Not much room to run, giving one to the seventh. Didn't get much on first down, it's second and nine. And those physical runs take a toll. It might not be a big game now, but down the road, third, fourth quarter, late in the ball games, they tend to turn into bigger runs. They pick up the first down on the drag route. I know that seems like a simple route, but it's actually a lot more complex than what it looks like because that route changes based on whether it's man or zone. If it's man coverage, he's flying across the field. If it's zone, he's got to sit down over the ball and a side.
They go to the draw. Brought down at... They go to the ground. He now has 91 yards on the ground, and that's just another routine day for this guy who's been among the nation's leaders in rushing all season long. Fires to the middle. Complete downfield. They just gashed the defense on that one, and they've got it down to the 23. Now let's see if they can follow up that huge play. First and 10 from the 23. They'll give it to the back. You'll take four yards on first down every time, second and six. Stanford hoping to pay off this red zone opportunity. The give to the running back from the shotgun. Drives into the defense, and they get him down after a pickup of three to the 16. A field goal here will put them on top, but a touchdown's what you want in a game like this. Oh, the ball squirts out. Oh, it looks as if the defense got it. And he's brought down, and this defense gets the ball back for its own. They'll leave it with him. Got room at the 35. Speeding down the left side. The 30. He's at the 20. And he ran away from the defense. Back to pass, it's Daniels. Finds a tight end. He's brought down, but there's a flag on the field. Let's see what the call is. Illegal flag on the back. Offense. Offense. Wants to throw on first down. He's got it. And he's down at the 41. That's a first down. He threw that one with some serious heat. This senior quarterback doesn't need a lot of space to get it in there. Quick strike complete. And he'll make his way out of bounds after the solid pickup. Well, you can tell those two have been practicing. They want to just keep throwing it quickly to the tight end. He's got enough to move the chains, and they'll spot it at the 47. These routes have some reads and adapt. On third and long, he has to throw for it. He slings it deep to the left. Set to snap it on first down. But well, to play the quarterback position, you do have to have a short memory. And this quarterback would love to have some throws back. He's thrown a couple picks already, but he's still out there taking chances and trying to make some plays for this offense. Nobody open. He just throws it away, and it'll bring up second down. Got a man. It's McCoy. They stop him almost immediately. Short game there, and still a little ground cover to pick up the first. You know. Turning to the running game on first and goal. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. They lost ground on first down. Now second and goal from the five. The run up the middle, trying to find his way to the goal line. They'll come out on this drive and let it rip. And that incomplete pass caused by the big hit on first down, second down coming. They'll line up for a second down play. The play action fake. Throws to the tight end. Caught over the middle. It's McCoy. And the tackle is made, but not before. That completion gets them 30-plus. This quarterback has been really good to him. He's been on top of it, seeing things really, really well. That pass right there put him over the 300-yard mark. It's a pretty good day. He's brought down, but there's a flag on the field. Let's see which way that's going to go. <laughs> The officials offer the deal, and the coach accepts it. They will take the penalty. Shoves back behind the chains. It's first and 15. It's complete on the right side, and they're able to make the tackle. I think if you're the head coach at this point, you're telling your eye. Off play action. 
action on first down. And this sophomore able to wreak some havoc and get the sack. They'll try to keep that sack from wrecking this drive here on second and 15. Looking left. Excellent coverage and good use of the hands to knock it away. This is a third and long. Looking downfield, it's Daniels. He fires one deep down the right side. Chopping up this defense, and they've got it all the way down to the 23. He wants to throw. Into the end zone. And he wanted to get the score right there, but it falls incomplete. Defense rolls up deep in its own end on that last play. Now a second and long coming. Going for six. He's got it in the end zone. Touchdown, Stanford. Field shrinks. Tight end grows. Big targets, big results. <laughs> I've never heard it put that way. What's your name, right? That guy is so big. A lot of times you get a DB matched up on him, he can just post him up. They'll throw it on first down. And this will be incomplete. A big hit there forces second down. Couldn't make the connection last time. Let's see if they throw it again. On second down, they'll take to the air. That's caught. It's Bachmeyer. He's close to the first down, but they're going to mark him just a little short. No time to waste here. They've got to get set and pick up chunk yardage. He's looking to throw on third and short. He's got his man. He puts him in business across the 50 into the 46-yard line. It'll be first down. On second down, he'll let it fly. All kinds of room to throw that one in there. And chunk plays are the name of the game, and they get one here before the defense finally makes a stop. That's what's so scary about this. Back to throw, it's Daniels. Got it! He's down at the one, and they almost had the touchdown pass on that one. It's definitely the wide receiver's job to create space, right? So whether you're running a go or you're running a hitch like this right here, I got to find a way. He's got it for the touchdown, and now they need the two-point conversion. Yeah, I tell you what, great job by this offense, great execution. You drive down the field, you get the score. Now what's your two-point play? You practiced it all week. What's your go-to in this moment, late in the fourth quarter, when you need the two-point conversion? And guys, as big as that touchdown was, they have to try to pay it off with a two-point try to tie the game. He's got it. The two is good, and we are all tied up in the fourth. A 70-yard touchdown drive. It was capped up. Trying to start the drive with a pass. Got him downfield. Touchdown! Going to run it. It's Wallace. That play just never had a chance. They knock him down for a loss of five. Second down coming up. Trying to move the sticks on third down through the air. And it's incomplete despite oh, some serious arm strength shown there. I tell you what, I don't know if the offense was expecting man cover. Are you kidding me? After the touchdown, if they could get this two, we'll have a tie ball game. Plus the pass. He's into the end zone. Two-point conversion is good, and we've got a tie game. Let's do it again.
again, guys, shall we? And we'll see just how far down the play sheet they have to go for this two-point try. Well, jet sweep pass. They can't get it done on the two, and now they'll rely on the defense. So now they'll need the answer to keep this game alive. Offense will use a timeout here to make sure everyone is on the same page here in overtime. This will be the ball game. Make it and play on. Miss it and lose. Trying to punch it in. And another answer. We're tied again. And let's keep playing, kids. Backs with the quarterback as they line up with a two. Dropping back, it's Daniels. They got it done. A great play call to give them the lead by two. What the fuck? Now they'll have to respond with a two of their own. They'll go to the air. He's got it for the two, and we're all tied up. And now they'll try to get the two-point conversion, guys. Motion from the offense. Quick touch pass to the receiver. They got it done with the two, and now they hold the edge deep in overtime. I know how to sum up this game to save you. That was fun, and we're to remember for them fun to go. Holy shit. Uh, are so nip and tuck, and you know every play matters so much. These are the games that, that we love to play. Yeah, every play matters, Dave, and that's why coaching staffs practice overtime scenarios and situations throughout the week. It's important to drill these types of scenarios. You never know what games are going to go to OT, and when they do, you love to be able to go out and execute with the game on the line. That's going to do it for us from here for Jesse Palmer, Dave Pollock, I'm Reese Davis, and this has been another presentation of EA Sports College Football.